Master the lingo, understanding, sets, in fitness. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to tackle an important term in the world of fitness and exercise. Sets. If you've ever been in a gym, or if you're starting to delve into workout routines, you've likely heard this term before. But don't worry if you're still unsure about what it means. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of what a set is in the context of fitness and exercise. In fitness terminology, a set refers to a specific number of repetitions of a particular exercise that you complete without stopping. For example, if you're doing push-ups and you decide to do 10 push-ups at a time, then you have completed one set of 10 push-ups. The concept of sets plays a crucial role in structuring your workout. How many sets you choose to do of an exercise can significantly impact your training intensity and your overall workout goals. Whether you're aiming to build strength, endurance, or muscle size, the number of sets you decide to perform can help you reach your objectives. In the fitness world, there are some commonly followed set structures that vary based on your workout goals. Straight sets. This involves performing the same number of repetitions for the same exercise for all your sets. For example, three sets of 10 repetitions each of bicep curls. Pyramid sets. In this case, you either increase or decrease the weight and adjust the number of repetitions across sets. For example, you may start with a set of 15 repetitions with light weight, then do a set of 10 with medium weight, and finally a set of 6 with heavy weight. Supersets. This involves doing two different exercises back to back with no rest in between, usually targeting opposing muscle groups. Drop sets. You start with a heavier weight, perform it to failure, then drop the weight and continue to perform reps until failure. This process is repeated one or more times. Remember, it's always important to choose the set structure that aligns with your fitness goals and current ability level. And there we have it. You've just learned what a set is in fitness, its role in your workout, and some of the common set structures used in fitness routines. Remember, planning your sets thoughtfully can help you achieve your workout goals more effectively. We hope this video has been helpful, and you're now more confident in understanding and using the term, set, in your fitness journey. Happy exercising!